All right, uh, quick boxwood talk slash topiary. The topiary in the middle, that one's now one year old. The topiary, not the tree. And then this one, this is how this one came out. You can kind of see it, but it's kind of sunny, but the shape is right there. The how to, I'll uh, comment down below. And, um, but yeah, that's how that came out. And then door spruce can be a little hard. You can see that one's drying out. So next year, this one will be a little more compact like this one, because this one was not as compact as it is now. They put on new growth. And then the two boxwoods up front, those are rescue plants that I got from the yard waste last fall. I couldn't help myself, so they had a decent root ball and they were huge. They were like three by three or three by four or something like that. Well, the shape, the, the round was uh, like four, three feet wide. There were, there was five of them. These two, the growth on these two survived and now they're a topiary or if I let them fill in, they'll be a shrub again. I'm not sure how old they are, but, but yeah, you don't have to really, I planted these tilted. As you can see, I covered it with dirt. You shouldn't do that, but these are free plants and they should be fine. Uh, if you get a new plant, definitely don't do that. But like I said, uh, they'll be fine. I cut off the other large branches and now I'll stake them and then uh, this I'll probably turn into a little heart or a ball something stake it and that will be it I'll try to keep the dirt off of the these branches so they should be fine and so yeah I, uh, I couldn't help myself I took them brought them home and now they'll I'll put them in some in some containers some pots they should look nice and i figured why not right so and then how to propagate them it's really easy there's two green velvet boxwoods in here cuttings you can see the two that survived literally just stuck them in there that was it and then you see it has mulch and just regular dirt uh i have green green velvet boxwoods and so I knocked the snow off they fell on the some of the couple branches fell on the ground and this is I just stuck them in there and now they're growing so so yeah if you want boxwoods that's how easy they grow just I guess do more and I didn't even really water them so whatever rainwater they got or whenever I remembered 